is for me. Hey, girl. I will Hello. 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 See if it notifies. It should go. Hey, there it is. Huh? There it is. Who's watching with us? Y'all know we can't see anything. Hello, hello. Let us know we're watching so we can tell you a hello. Yes, let us know where you're watching. Hello. Oh, Lord. No, I got it. I got it. We can see it. Hi, Belle. Hey, TJ. Hey, Beth. Hey, Alicia. Hey, Angie. 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 Hey,
It's not the small box that uh-uh. if you've ever ordered from it. It's a huge it's box. It's a huge box, y'all. Look how big these boxes are. They're huge. Oh, Lisa says her favorite is Esther. Yay. Yes. Look how big these boxes are. These boxes are huge. These boxes are huge. They are going to be full of things. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Heather says, how do we get the box? Um, Vanessa, Vanessa, drop, drop the link, link to the box. Please drop the link to the or box. Or someone who has the link to the box, drop okay. the link to the box. <laughs> So in yes, these boxes, Bobby, we can't wait to get you your get a hundred a uh, hundred dollars worth of goodies for forty five dollars. We're yes. filling these boxes up. Yes, we're filling. Look up, look up. First of all, look how beautiful this is. It's so we're pretty, filling, y'all. We're filling it up. You get yes. <laughs> I must have missed it. You get a hundred dollars worth of goodies for only forty five dollars, y'all. Yes. So we had to go buy a box today. So if you bought a box uh la- over the weekend. Your stuff is ships Wednesday. That's what yes, we're going to do yes. all Wednesday is mail stuff out. But we had to go get big boxes. So oh, Lacey, we will definitely be praying for you. So, yes, if you're interested in a Girl Open Your Bible mystery box. So, we have a boutique here where we're located in Bentonville, Arkansas. And so, we have some great inventory. We thought, you know what? Let's surprise everyone. Get them to order. Put some expensive stuff in there that's great. Every box will come with a t-shirt, y'all. Yes. Every mystery box. Every box comes, with, comes a with a t-shirt. Okay, there's a link. Yeah. Okay. Every box comes with a t-shirt. Yes. And it's a special t-shirt. <laughs> it's a very special t-shirt. It's a very to special us. t-shirt. It means a lot to us. It means so much to yeah, us. Yeah, it means a lot to us. And so each box will come. We, I'm giving it away. Okay. Say, say, shut just up, just say it comes with a t-shirt. That's it. it. Comes, okay. 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 Next. Okay. If anyone's on here, you're new or not, you need yeah. a Bible, message us. Message us. Message us. Um, we will send you the link tree. What was the link tree below? Yep. No. No, Kaylee. It will be all new stuff. It's all other stuff. Yes, Kaylee. it's all other stuff. Kaylee was Kayla. like, what? How do I, mean, I like, know? Yes, yes. Kaylee, all other stuff. Kaylee, all other stuff. She okay, like, so Anna, if you go on and you purchase a box, it'll have the size. What size? You have right. to order the box in your yeah, size. Yeah, you order the box that's how by we your did size, it. which is the t-shirt size. Yeah, that's how we did it. Yeah, that's how we did it. Okay. Well, we say, thank you. She, she <laughs> said, you got, got my attention. attention. Yeah. <laughs> but Kaylee was like, I think I ordered it. Okay. Mm-hmm. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. I just said. Uh, but look. if you're new, old here, and you need a Bible, girl, yeah. message us. Heather, it comes in all sizes. Just, just click yes, the link. Yes, just click the link. All the sizes. All, all the sizes. We promise you, all the sizes are there. Oh, to four and sell. Okay, yeah, to all the sizes sale. are there. Four XL. Okay, we are. Mm-hmm. You know, we're thick girls, so we we don't. Yeah, we, we get all the sizes. That's girl, all I'm saying. We yeah. get all the sizes. And when we work with vendors, it's like, how hard, how high do you go? When they say extra large, they say large. You we're don't like, get no, them. we can't. You don't then get we the won't. business. You no, don't get it. We you can't order from you then. Can't order for you. No. If I can't wear it, boo boo. Yes, no. Uh uh-uh, uh. And if no. I couldn't wear it at my heaviest, you definitely not gonna get yes. it. Yes. Hey, Yvonne. Hey, Hi, Yvonne. Okay. You're fine. Okay, Hi, so boo-boo. once I keep saying this, and I feel like I haven't finished. New or old here need a Bible? Message us. Message us. And we will send you a Bible for free. Yes. Um, and last but not least, last but not least, if anybody is on here is interested in the coaching academy, becoming a oh. certified biblical life coach, y'all, we're starting a new class on yes, May seventh. May seventh. That is hot. That is hot news. Hey Mercedes. May seventh. So please yeah. message us, like girls. I want to. I need to do my interview for the. Yeah, for the coaching academy. Just click we the need link. to drop the link. We yeah. need to drop the link. Drop okay. the link. She drop the link. Did. Drop it again. Vanessa, Just keep please. dropping the link, Vanessa. I saw that you dropped please it. Keep dropping the link. Just keep dropping this link. So y'all. Okay, normally we do a recap here. Guess what? We'll have no recap. We don't so have I'll tell no you recap. what we're starting with. Girl! 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 Open your Bible! Okay. Drop a girl. Y'all, we also want to know what translation what you are reading in. Sierra, what translation are you reading in? CSB, because last time I failed at King James. Okay. <laughs> oh, that was you. If you want to go back and have a good laugh. Go back and watch the live where Sierra was trying to read from the King James. We love King James, okay? Let me tell you. I, I love so to confident. read from King James and something else. Yeah. I was so confident, y'all. Struggle bus. My brain was like, uh, Shrug- uh, struggle bus. Uh, uh, That's all I'm going to say. Okay? The Lord was like, don't do that. Um, I am reading for the message translation, <laughs> which I love. Yes. Um, and y'all, um, James has a special place in my heart. I love me some James. 
So, we're going to turn the music down. And y'all, we're going to get into the word. And we want to know what translation y'all are reading in. We always suggest reading multiple translations. If you're on here, you're like, y'all, reading the Bible, sometimes I get lost. Right? We're going to say, find a different translation. Reading a couple translations. Message is great. That's the one I'm going to be reading in today. So, Sierra, would you like to start? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, she would. I was just trying to read. I was trying to get, like, some, like, our Bibles, they come with, like, fun facts about, you know, each book. So, I was yeah, trying to hurry yeah. up and read something. And in my She Reads Truth Bible, it just, it mentioned that James, see, let me flip through real quick. It mentioned that James continually called for obedience to the law of God, mm. showing believers that their obedience to God's moral standards was an indication of a living a living faith. Mm. Some choose to oversimplify the distinctions between the Old Testament and the New Testament by saying that the Old Testament is grounded in the word in the works, and yeah. the New Testament is yeah. grounded in faith. James brings both testament together to show that faith and works are. And, and they're together. Yeah, faith and works Related are in both the Old and the New. Co- I new, love that. New Testaments. Covenants. Old and okay. New Covenants. Okay. So I thought that was beautiful. And so everyone, obey. Okay. That's what we're calling, we're yes. calling obedience here. Yes. And yes. I'm, the Lord told us to do James and Esther. And we're all are about to see. Yeah. All about to be yes. made aware why yes. together. You know, a lot of people like, how do you guys get the next topic? God tells yes. us. We open our yes. Bible and he tells us. And so we're all about to see why the Lord is pairing Old Testament story. Oh, Shauna Esther. is new here. Hi, Hi Shauna. Shauna. Welcome. And New Testament, James together. So I read that and it just caught my attention. And Heather. Heather is new here. Welcome, ladies. Get, get on back. Let Hi, me log off here. I don't want the book of James. <laughs> I said your name right. Right. No, y'all, it's going to, it'll read us a little bit. Hi, Anita. Yes. Hey, Anita. Okay. You, girl. Okay. Here I go. James 1. James J- 1, y'all. James, read a servant of God. Translation. Yep. And okay. of the Lord Jesus Christ to the 12 tribes dispersed abroad. Greetings. That is also Old Testament okay. lingo right here. Okay. So everybody calling it out. That is Old Testament sure stuff. Is. And as we study the Old Testament, you know, books, of, you, you're going to hear the tribes, tribes, tribes. So getting that out there. So, he's talking, so who is he talking to? When you see t- tribes, he's talking to who? Everybody. Yes. He's talking to you, me, everybody. We all look different here. That's okay, Father. Mm. He's talking to each and every one of us okay. here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody. Yeah. Trials yes. and maturity. Yes, to you. To, to you. me. He's talking to you. To he's Sierra. talking to me. Yes. This is who he's talking to. Here. Everybody. Consider, everybody and their mom. <laughs> consider, <Okay. laughs> consider it great joy, my brothers and sisters. Whenever you experience various trials. Didn't we just read this the other day? I think Be- we did. Because you know that testing of your faith produces endurance. Mm. And let your endurance have its full effect so that you may be mature and complete and lack nothing. Y'all, we got to stop there. We have we have to stop there. I want to oh, read it in the message translation, okay? Yeah. In the message translation, it says, Consider it a sheer gift, friends. When tests and challenges come at you from all sides, you know that under pressure, under pressure, your faith life is forced into the open oh. and shows its true colors. Woo wee! So don't try to get out of anything prematurely. Let it let it do its work, so you become mature and well developed, not deficient in any way. Look, I mean, y'all, it's so hard to say, <laughs> right? Consider it a gift. Consider it a gift. When tests and challenges come your way. That's that's hard to... That's, that's okay, hard. it's like I can't fathom that. Does anybody consider it a gift okay. when you're going through life? Okay, when I life, don't... When life be life in? It's hard to consider that a gift. It's hard to consider it. We 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 feel the the reverse. Okay, right. right. We, we, oh, we, we do. This is when we feel unloved. This is when, when all the feel, thoughts oh, come in. We feel like God isn't we, there. Yeah, well, this is when we feel in... James is challenging all of us. Consider it great joy. Right here we go again, mm-hmm. just like Jesus on the Sermon on the Mount. He's, they're saying, counter what yes, you have heard what before. you know. Counter the world, what the world would say. The world would say, blessed looks like what? All the riches, the fame, the family. Mm-hmm. That's what the world would yep. say, yep. blessed looks like. Yep. Yep. But blessed are those who what, right? Yep. And does James say, uh, <laughs> counter it all great joy when you experience it's life. It's a gift. And your faith is tested and make sure you go through all of it. Don't shortcut that oh, darn endurance. It shows its true colors. It shows its true colors. 
And oh, y'all, that's how we get Wait. stronger. <laughs> y'all, that's how we get stronger. Oh, uh, just you know, we gotta watch the words you say. Yes, you know, yes. I'm like, I hope my faith looks strong, but then I'm like, oh, oh it's Lord, be Lord, don't, don't test that. Don't Lord. test that. Don't test that. Right? Yeah, it, this is my true reaction. I'm like, to Lord, this. Lord, you done already tested some things. Lord, I don't you, know. Lord. I don't know if I need another one. Lord. <laughs> <laughs> said walking on water like never before walking yes. on water like never before so here's the thing mm. do we want to go through those hard things no but no. that's when our faith and our character mm -hmm. is developed that's when we become mm. mature that's when we become mature just and that's when you be like the the grandmas and the mothers that be like god's yes. got it yes fight, you stop fighting that thing yes god's already got it you see when you know you know faith be like that and like god's already got it what do you don't have to do nothing? Yeah. Don't you see? Don't you see his hand on there, there, yeah. there? That's them old, the old, you know, yes. the mothers yes. of this that yes. would say, girl, he already fixed it. Yeah, yeah. Like Why? Heather because said, they, we, don't, faith has been tested. we don't get stronger. Yeah, we don't get stronger in the calm times. Think about that. How do you get stronger? <laughs> That's so good, Heather. Heather. How do we get stronger? Right? Ooh, we, we work out, and so we do a lot of weight lifting, right? Yes. Y'all, the Strong. weights are heavy. The weights are heavy. The weights are I heavy. I promise she be mad when we miss, when we come back. And okay. Like, are you taking that on? My us? legs hurt so bad. My arms will hurt so bad. But y'all, when that like pressure that. is applied, right? And it says this here. Yeah, under pressure. Under pressure. Even yes. physically, when our bodies are under pressure, when we're doing those weights, that's how we get stronger. Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm. So the Lord knows how he set this thing up. He knows how he set it up. We're gonna move on because okay. we only in we only in four. Oh my goodness. We're only in James 1 4. But okay. that's good. Now, if any of you lacks wisdom, Ooh. he should ask God. There it is, right here. Why y'all in this group? To ask God. Not ask us. Yes. To ask God. What we say is open up your Bible. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go look at episode one of the podcast. Yeah. Okay. He okay. says it. If you don't know what you're doing, pray to the Father. Pray Amen. to the Father. Amen. Who gives to all generously and ungrudgingly, and it will be given to you. Ask, you will receive. Oh. Okay, I'm, I'm tripping. This Ooh, is good. Jesus. Okay, read it. That's so good. Okay, if you don't know what you're doing, pray to the Father. He loves to help. Y'all, he the does. Holy Spirit loves to help. Hey, all those helpers in the room. Okay, it says <laughs> you'll get his help. And won't be condescended to when you ask for it. Oh. Y'all, have y'all ever asked oh. something and people talk down to you? Okay. People you love. Even people you love. Or even, you us, ask them? Or even, or even we the people that be okay. like condescending. Yeah. Or we condescend somebody else. Is that yeah. what you're saying? Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. But it's like when we ask for him, he, he's like, that ain't a stupid question. There are no stupid questions. Ask me. And that means we can ask him anything. 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 Mercedes said when she first read James, she was like, oh, girl, that's what we getting today. And I, I read James and it's like it's brand new. But that's how the word it is. Yvonne says, ask God, then be patient. Yes. Hey, but, Berna, yeah, watch the replay, girl. Okay. You but go. let him ask in faith without doubting. All right, mm -hmm. now, there was a requirement here. Now, when you ask. Ooh. You better have faith, girl, that he gave you the answer yeah. and stop doubting. Yeah. Because what happens is you be doubting like, did he really say what he just said? Right. Right. That th yep. Don't doubt. Don't He's doubt. speaking to you. Yeah. Don't doubt. For the doubter is like mm. the surgeon's sea, driven and tossed by the wind. Woo-wee. You all see? That is... That is you, a, you gotta finish. You gotta finish. Okay, this okay. message is messy. That person should not expect to receive anything from the Lord. Being double-minded and unstable in all his ways. Yes, Heather, we get confidence through obedience and surrender. I want to read to you what the message says. People who worry their prayers are like wind-whipped waves. Don't think you're going to get anything from the master that way, right? Adrift that seed, keeping all your options open. Lord, Y'all, the Lord is our only option. <sighs> He is our only option, y'all. Only option. Okay. Go ahead We're about to have a good Zoom we tonight. We sure are. We sure are. Let the brother of humble circumstances boast in his exaltation. But let the rich boast in his humiliation. Because he will pass away like a flower of the field. 
for the sun rises and together with the scorching wind dries up the grass and its flowers falls off and its beautiful appearance perishes. In the same way, the rich person will wither away while pursuing his activities. I want to, let ahead. me read. I don't want to read all of it. When down and outers get a bright cheer, right? That's that whole, okay. And when the arrogant rich are brought down to size, cheer. I think that's that whole first yeah. will be last, yeah, right? Last will be and first. last will be first. But I love what it says here. Um, and that's a picture of the prosperous life. At the mm-hmm. very moment everyone is looking on his admiration, it fades away to nothing. So look, we can't put our hope in that. We got to put our hope in the Lord. Yeah. Right? And we can't have no other options. Mm-hmm. Basically, that's what I get out of that. Dang it. I lost my uh, place getting all emotional. Okay. Wait. Pause. We were watching this uh, reel a couple weeks ago, and it was like, how do you study the Bible? Are you the crier? <laughs> <laughs> and then it, it was like, are you the crier? Or are you the, are you the, I don't, or are you the confused one, right? It's just like, I don't know what's going on here, right? <laughs> are you the preacher? So you read it, and then you get a word, and we're you gonna immediately. We're going to have and share that here. It was so funny. Yeah. And I told her, I said, you the crier. She was like, no, 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 no. I'm like, Okay. Proceeds to cry. <laughs> Proceeds to cry all the time. Look, TJ, Sarah, thank you all. Thank too. you, my crier sisters. I'm sitting over here like. Whoosh! <laughs> 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 that is funny. All right. Okay. Blessed is the one who endures trials, Ooh. because oh when he God. has stood the test, he will receive the crown of life. That God has promised to those who love him. No one undergoing a trial should say, I'm being tempted by God. Since God is not Mm -hmm. tempted by evil, he himself doesn't tempt anyone. But each person is tempted when he is drawn away and enticed by his own evil desire. And then after desire has conceived, it gives birth to sin. And when sin is fully grown, Mm -hmm. it gives birth to death. Don't be deceived, my dear brothers and sisters. Every good and perfect gift is from above, coming down from the Father of Lights. There's this beautiful song Hmm. um, called The Father of Lights by Sunday, and it's so good. Who does not change like shifting shadows? By his own choice, he gives us birth by the word of truth, so that we would be a kind of first fruit of Hmm. his creatures. I love it. I love it. That's beautiful. Um, I'll give a quick synopsis and message. Anyone who meets a testing challenge head on and manages to stick it out is mighty out. fortunate. Stick it out, girl. What that say? Don't give up. Yeah. That means like it's it's that means it's coming. So let's let's so but we w- can't give up. We can't get up. So let's say it real. Girl, you facing something that you really want but you know you shouldn't. Mhm. Endure. That's what yes. we're saying. There's something that endure. you really want and you already know it's bad. Endure. Yep, endure. Endure. Resist. Keep, resist. Yes. Yes. Resist. 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 You can do it, right? Yep. yep. The Bible says when we resist the devil, he will flee. flee. So yes. resist. Resist. Um, I, I written, love the way. Flee. Resist. I love the, the visual I get here. Um, lust gets pregnant. And yes. has a baby. Mm-hmm. And they're saying that's sin. So lust. Lust. Has a baby. And that baby is sin. Yep. And sin grows up to adulthood. And becomes a real killer. And that's when we don't. Re- that's like. That's sin and knowing. Letting stuff fester. Mm-hmm. And continue on. And continue right? on. Yep. Because when Take something is off. a baby. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like. And then it's an adult. That's different. That's different, of course. We yeah. know that, but that's different. Those are two different things we're trying to fight, mm-hmm. right? Okay. Yes, Erica, still killing and destroy. Same All comes day. to still killing and destroy. Okay. Resist hearing and doing the work, my dear sisters. Understand this: everyone should be quick to listen, mm-hmm. slow to speak, slow to anger. For human anger does not accomplish God's righteousness. Therefore, ridding yourselves of all moral filth mm-hmm. in the evil and the evil that is so prevalent. Mm-hmm. Humbly, hum, humbly 
receive the implanted word which is able to save your souls. This is for all mm. of us. Mm. It sure slow is. to anger, slow yep. to anger, slow to anger, slow yep. to speak. Lord, help me be slow to speak and slow to anger. Ooh. Slow to speak. And let me tell you, that's, that that sounds anger. easier than it slow is. Slow to speak and slow to anger because it's so so much easier to say these words to y'all. I look. I love what this <laughs> says. But I'm gonna do let, it. Let our gardener, God, yes. landscape you with the word. With the word, y'all. <laughs> landscape. Let him know. landscape us with the word. Okay. Oh, beautiful. Making a salvation garden of your life. Mm-hmm. That's beautiful. That imagery. is beautiful imagery, right? Have you ever seen like an abandoned house or something, and how horrible the yard looks? Uh huh. So it's like let God let God landscape us with His Word. Yeah, with His Word. And guess what, y'all? That's the Open that's up the your Bible, Bible, right? And make a garden out of it. Mm. Okay, go ahead. But be doers of the word and not hearers only, deceiving yourselves. I love this because it mm-hmm. says deceiving yourself because you're right. deceiving the Lord. Okay. You're only deceiving yourself. I'm only deceiving okay. myself, not God. Because if anyone is a hearer of the word and not a doer, he is like someone looking at his own face in the mirror. For he looks at himself and goes away and immediately oh, forgets you know what kind of person he was. Yep. But the one who looks intently into the perfect law of freedom and preserves it in it and is not for a forgetful oh. hearer, but a doer who works, this person will be blessed in what he does. You, you know I've got to read it Okay. in the message. Message. <laughs> Don't fool yourself into thinking that you are a listener when you are anything but letting the word go in one ear and out the other. Oh. Act on what you hear. Hey. Whew. Those who hear and don't act are like those who glance in the mirror, mm-hmm. walk away, and two minutes later have no idea who they are or what they look like. And y'all, it seemed like, well, I know what I... Okay, we was like, I know what I look like. And then you ever seen a picture of yourself? Sometimes you be like, uh, uh-uh, I gotta go on a diet. <laughs> <laughs> like, I know what I look like. And then you get a bad picture and you be like, that ain't... You be like, is that me? Do I look like that? You know, I took this beautiful picture of you today. I think you're going to think opposite. But sometimes it can be the opposite. Like, ooh, I looked good. You, you know, it's I forgot like. How good I, I forgot how good I looked. But sometimes. That's what, we, y'all, we got to act. We got to act on his word. We have to act on what we hear. We do. But for, and for those of you who are legit seeking after him day in, day out, you open, like this, this talk about letting the <laughs> word. They said, I know you lying. Is that me? <laughs> <laughs> Yep, that's what we talk about. Um, <laughs> so, for those of you who are seeking His Word, opening up your body, yeah, this is legit talking to you. You can hear God; He's speaking right to you. Yeah, you're right reading, here, y'all. Right here. here. Like now, don't forget it. Don't forget, Lord. Don't forget, Lord. Please, so like, I think all of us, Lord. Pr- Lord, Lord, I pray over yes. my mind. I pray over my mind, yes. Lord. Let me remember and I'll your watch words. You, Father. Yes, yes. yes Lord, Lord. Give, continue to give it to me in other ways, yes. so I may not yes. forget. So I act. So I want to be a. I want to be a person who acts. Yes. I don't want to just to just hear and don't do. Right, and let's be a person that asks the Lord, because that's yes. what it's talking about. Yes. Asking yes. the Lord. Yes. And we're about to read Esther, right? And we're yep. about to see how these stories go. Pow. Yep. However. Let's let us be someone that asks the Lord directly. Yeah. That's what He requires of us. Yeah, that's what He yeah. wants. Because that's exactly what this is saying. If anyone thinks he is religious without controlling his tongue, his religion is useless and deceives himself. Pure and undefiled religion before God, the Father, is this: to look after mm-hmm. orphans and widows in their distress, and to keep oneself unstained from the world. What you'll say? Okay. Okay, message. We message. are James 26 to 27. Anyone who sets himself up as religious by talking a good game is self-deceived. This kind of religion is hot air and only hot air. Real religion, the kind that passes muster, the kind that passes muster before God the Father is this. Reach out to the homeless and loveless in their plight 
and guard against corruption from the godless world. So yeah, why, what does that mean? That that's that's saying once again, don't just say stuff with your mouth and you not doing nothing. What are you gonna have to do? You're gonna have to do, girl. We have to be hearers and doers of the word. Girl, you're gonna have to do. That's what that says to me. You're gonna have to do. And that's for all of us. That's for all of us. Yep. Girl, you're gonna have to do. Yep, we gotta do. Continually. Yep. Continually. Continually. Continuously. Continually renew your mind, girl. Continually, you know, do what he says. Continue. Continue. Obey. 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 Yeah. Today the Lord said, do something. We did it. And he said, all right. There we go. Yep. There you go. Right there. Yeah. He was right there. Now you get what you asked for. Yep. Obey. Now you get what you asked for. I told y'all, but obey. (laughs) (laughs) So we tell y'all. Obey. Obey. Okay, now we're hopping on the Zoom. You guys ready? Yeah, and that's for those if, for those who are new. We also have a Patreon. The Patreon helps pay for the free Bibles that we're able to get out for ladies who might need them. Yes. So once again, if you're new here or old here, need a Bible, message us directly. Message. Say, girl, I need a Bible. Mm-hmm. But um, for those Patreon members, then um, we have a Zoom Monday nights, right after the Bible study, we'll just mm-hmm. go a little bit deeper. Yeah, it's our gift to them for Your, saying thank yeah, you yeah. for supporting the girls. Yep. Getting the Bibles and the life coaching and the DMs. Yeah, and the life coaching and the DMs. Okay. All right. See you guys there. Also, somebody just joined the Patreon. The link is inside of there, and we'll send you a message, too. Yes, we will. Or an email. Yeah. All right. Bye. Bye. Open your Bible. Girl. 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 Open your Bible. Bye.